Hey everybody, it's Jennifer again from PopPieGirl.com. I wanted to make another quick video to show something that I do to help ensure or at least help with the success of my Squidoo lens. And when I am looking for profitable ideas for my lenses, there's always another little filter test I send it through to see if I actually want to build a lens on it. Uh, right now I am back in one of my favorite profitable niche discovery tools and that's Keyword K9. And I believe they're going to be closing the doors to that very shortly. So if you want it, you better get in while you can. But I am in that magical area right button up here called niches. And they just keep this running ongoing list of little niches that they discover. And that's what I love to find is those little profitable niches. Uh, what I do is I isolate it. I filter it down to only give me the very easy ones. And then I click filter, which is over here outside the screen. And I've already done that. And here are the list of little keyword niche ideas that they're coming back with. So I would just come through and take a look. Like I said, I don't worry about search volume because I know I can pick up other search terms from the content of my lens. And once I find products to go with it, product names, etc. So right now I'm just really just going through this one. Typical Thanksgiving menu would highlight that copy and just paste it over here in a notepad file. I can see myself working with that one. Uh, spinners for bikes. Just going to grab some ideas here and show you what I do next. Uh, boat shade umbrella. Funny newlywood questions. Uh, that actually it could be fun to make a lens on that. So I'll put that over here. Uh, let's see. Greeting card kits, interesting. That's something I could probably work with. Copy that, paste it over on my little notepad. Uh, Disney Toy Castle, there's another one. Mm -hmm. That would be a great tangible product from Amazon to work with. Uh, let's find one more. Lady Luck costumes. I like doing Halloween stuff, so let's copy that. And put that over there. All right, I have a few. Next, I go over to Google. And I am going to tell Google, hey, tell me any pages on the Squidoo site that has my exact phrase in the title of their lens. Ultimately, all I care about is the title of the lens. Because whether they have it on their page or not, that doesn't really make true competition for me. But if it's in the title, I don't really want to compete with another lens. So I would do that search for that I'm gonna search and look at that first one I got lucky with what I want is this right here where it says did not match any documents that means Google is saying in their index they have no pages from the squidoo.com site that have that exact phrase typical Thanksgiving menu in the title and that right there will be an instant winner for me I could run with that uh, talk about a typical menu, the cookware maybe you use with it, where to buy the supplies, uh, doing your table. Uh, I could run with that all day. But that is just a very quick example of how I go from finding these profitable niche ideas to deciding if I'm actually going to use it or not. I hope that helps. I'll put all this down in the text so you can copy paste this into Google for yourself. And if you want Keyword Canine, I recommend getting in anytime you have an opportunity to. That's it. Thanks a lot for watching.